coming asking the questions yeah completely i mean it's uh, very positive tactic particularly against somebody that has ability to suddenly attack the ball and give you a couple of unforced errors possibility possibly good squeeze yeah. though working the ball in time there, nice and safe Werner Coles just working the four corners nicely here. That's tre tremendous pressure. What a rally there from Paul Cole. 10 9. Fantastic Game ball. squash. Really making it look quite. I mean, comfortable and it's <laughs> certainly not comfortable. Just a bit of extra bite on that cross court. More racket phase, Johnny. For Cole. Video referee decision on Abul Gar's appeal. Well, I thought he could have just played this. Uh, Abul, Abul Gar, he could have hit the straight quite comfortably. This on game ball, Joey, is playing with fire, asking for a letty. That is not a let, mate. No, he's got to play that. There's no, there's, there's no, he's not no danger the really there. For a stroke, so this to me. Oh, gosh. Needs to play that. That was. Uh, he gets no let in here. He will go nuts. Looks more like more of a no let from that angle. It's the uh, the other angle. The referee's deemed a no let. So he has been penalised. No Silly let. decision there from Abu Ghraib. Eleven nine game to call. Call leads one After game to such up. An intense first game, and I can't believe there's ten kgs difference in weight between these two. I mean, you're looking at the body types there. Pretty much similar height as well. Slipped a little bit there, Abu Elgar. Just absorbed it well, though. Tremendous plyometric strength. Doing well here. 3 2. It's Cole who's possibly gone a bit passive, Joey. Yeah, that was pretty. It's amazing defence, though, from Cole. Oh, Johnny, he's obviously heard what you said and he's uh, put you to bed there. Again. Head out 3 all. That all came from the lob. There was a lot of pressure front left-hand corner. Paul Cole changed the angle with the lob and then... That might just would work to his advantage a little bit because he... I don't know, it's, it's an interesting one because, you know, could it have given a bit of time for Paul Cole just to refocus? I mean... Goodness me, he's got it, he's got it. That's, oh, that's, that took a lot of nerve. I'll tell you what, please. when you've got an opponent that's flying around the court like that, it's such a crucial point in the match. There's been times where we'd have seen Abu Elgar put that right in the bottom of the tin and he made that count beautifully. Look at this, Johnny. Oh, that, that flick was incredible. Up. Look at the finish. Watch. Yeah. Oh, he's been in the Nile River. <laughs> Surprise me, we've had close to nearly 50 minutes of squash and we're only looking to complete the second game. be a stroke hit. Video referee decision on Abulgar's appeal. Well, Marco has passed the baton on to the video official. That to me looked like it could have possibly been a stroke but we'll watch it through. It's just our opinion as commentators. We're not referees Johnny. Although interesting there is Paul Coles trying to move to let him go on the inside and he's decided to go round I would say the outside but it's been given as a stroke. Stroke to Abulgar. 11-9 game to Abulgar. One game all. Well, Game on between these two. Well, this is the aggressive play that Abuel Gars just starting to push harder. Oh, what a length again, Cole, finding just incredible range. Hand out, five all. I love it. I just, I think it's fantastic. I mean, Abuel Gars is, I mean, he can't be any more drenched than what he is at the moment. I mean, <laughs> that does with interest. Done well. This is a great shot. Look at that shot. It just ran off the bat wall. Thought it was going to stay deeper. Well, I don't know if any of our any of us would have read that one. The old spaghetti legs. And out six nine. <laughs> Another good length there from Paul Cole. Eleven seven game. That has been the same Paul race in that game. One. Well, Paul Cole, very, very importantly, 
holding off Abu Elgar, who's dug deep. Picked up well, he's doing some work again here. Bullet. It's been a very good squash match, this Johnny. It's been top shelf, absolute top shelf. Abu Elgar brought his A game, that's what we wanted, oh, and that is A quality that all is the way. Quite sublime. And that was quite wonderful. Seven, four. Look at this. I mean, I love the way he just took the pace off it as well. Guided it in. I mean, blowing. Hand out five eight. What do you think, Johnny? Is going to a fifth? You got feeling? I wanted to. Just, as I said, as an absolute purist, I wanted to go to five. game balls to take this into a fifth. What a ripper, Johnny. Yeah, very intelligent. Oh, my <laughs> goodness gracious me. Eleven this is quite outrageous. Squish here. All. Hugely impressed by Abuel Guy, who's literally like a frogman in the Nile. He's completely and utterly soaked through. And he's not letting it get to him at all. We've seen it, haven't we, Johnny? We've seen it a lot of times with this bullet. That was uh, interesting. Oh, that's very tidy. That was very good control and movement, considering Paul Coles had a couple of slips. Seven four. Really held his his movement. I mean, what a match, though. I mean, it's unfortunate to see when you see that the quality of Abu Elgar diminishes so much in the fifth. But all credit to Paul Cole. And then he does that, and then he does that, and the crowd do what they do, and you know takes another rally. He's back in five the nine. Time. Yeah, unfortunately, this will do Paul Cole a massive amount of good. He's got a day's rest as well, Johnny, to recuperate. There we have it, and there's the error. Paul Cole, superb from him. Three games to two. Needs to be a, nine, a nine, big appreciation nine, seven, of what has gone eleven, on because the squash five. between these two players has been quite outrageously good. Superb match, the longest match we've had so far on the glass court. And Paul Cole manages to get a win over a bit of a bogeyman for him in the form of the very talented Mohamed Abu Elgar, 88 minutes, Johnny Boy. Just shy of the hour and a half in very warm, humid conditions here in Giza. And it's Paul Cole that hangs on to his seeding to move into the quarterfinals with a 3-2 victory. Ali Farag will do his uh, Austin Powers type lunging in a minute. <laughs> giving out the vibe. Jim Carrey. They will start in 15 seconds. Oh, I mean, honestly, there we go. There's the Jim Carrey vibe from Dumb and Dumber. <laughs> you remember that scene when they were at the bar? Music, please. <laughs> oh. CIB Egyptian Open 2021, means round three match. Mohamed Sherbin of Egypt to serve. Ali Farak of Egypt to receive. Best of five games, Labor. Range of movement in the swing, so... We've spoken about this guy's technical abilities, no doubt about that. It's, it's his movement that, that lets him down. and At the top level, he's never been able to show that he can sustain high quality movement for long enough against these types of players. Three love. And Farag over and bring him back deeper in the court. It's, it's just shooting with boasts and, and low kills from the back of the court. It's not going to work. No, not against one of the best movers in the world. Particularly when the ball's as lively as this, Johnny. The early stages of the match. Handout for six. That's, he had the position there to do that, so that's what he's got to work for. Yeah. yeah again, that movement just being left exposed a little bit. He wasn't, Ten, four, wasn't well balanced to play ball. that drop, and Farag, six game balls now. So from 3-love Shabini, it's been 10-1 Farag after that. 
Very, very clear. Strong That'll be another Farag. point for Farag as he wraps it up very comfortably. Very comfortably. Leave it forward, so give the Farag, Farag lead. Flying out the court. One game's too long. Untroubled after that first. In this last match of tonight's play, in the last of the round of 16, one lovely for the number two seed. Eight, love. Two, eight. Ali Farag is uh, keeping the crowd pretty quiet. We're saying about all those juniors that follow him. This is so comfortable, Johnny, that uh, they're not even needing to cheer, really. Game ball. Eight game balls for a two love lead. And we're looking at what, 20, 24 minutes, 23 now. minutes total? Yeah, it's proper lounge chair game squash two, for Farag. Farag. He's just Farag reclining leads, nicely. Two Yes, at first point of the game here. One love. So the cloud hovering about El Shavini's. And he's not chasing after it, and now he's calling. Too long. Self energy. You can have three minutes. Self energy. Derek, please. So, you see the three minute, three minute injury break. The shoes coming off. So it's something to, must be something to do with the lower limb there. So unfortunately, can't carry on. So Ali Farag will. Uh, there'll be the acknowledgement there. It's unfortunate there for Mohamed El Shabini. You know, he's had a great run into the last 16, and he's uh, looks like it's his hamstring. Yeah. Just uh, holding the back of his leg. Yeah. Mr. Shabini is retired. For a uh, very good run to love. Sadly, not able to do what he needed to do in the last 16 on okay. this this amazing Much venue. Much of through games to love setting. Ali Farag will we'll probably come round for a little bit of a chat with Natalie in a minute, but 25 minutes was all looking very good for Farag from the beginning, and unfortunately the body of Mohamed El Shabini breaking down, Johnny.